Hey guys, for this video we're going to take a look at these LED bulbs I picked up on Amazon. Now they come as a two pack and the packaging looks like this and they come in a bag like this. And here's the old incandescent bulb. I'm putting these in for the courtesy lights, the lights when the doors uh, are open, the lights that come on. Uh, this is for my 73 Corvette. Probably fits all sorts of like RVs, cars, trailers, boats, whatever. Now if we look at it, it has a single contact at the bottom. The little tabs are parallel, both at the base there. And it's just a little bit bigger than the original. And I think it's really important, I'm going to get some measurements for you here in a second, because uh, when I was looking up these light bulbs, I swear there would be different ones that all use the same model number, and then they would have different dimensions in the listing, or the listing wouldn't have any dimensions at all. So one thing about it is the shape is slightly different, and you have a hard shoulder right here, where the old glass one is more just, you know, a circle. So I'm hoping they fit in the socket just fine without any issues there. Now, if I can do this one-handed. So the new bulb, the height there, I don't know if you can read the screen, but it's 1.502. So one and a half inches, basically right on the money. And then the side is 0 0.591 inches. So a little over half an inch. So there it is real quick. I'm going to show you the incandescent bulb that's in there now, although you probably already know what that looks like. And then we'll see what the difference looks like having an LED in there. So here is your incandescent bulb. Ignore the spark plug wire in the seat. Quickly, another thing I think I'm going to like about these is this type of lens over the top almost acts as like a diffuser where this was just clear glass over uh, the filament or element, whatever. And um, I don't know, I think I like this, but let's throw it in. I got the driver's side in. One thing to mention is because of the shoulder on that LED bulb, it goes into the socket just fine, but it doesn't fit through the metal bracket that this socket pushes into. So you have to have the socket in place first and then put the bulb in. And it just makes it a little bit more difficult because it sure would be nicer just to put the bulb in while those wires are laying there. Got them both in, so let's check it out. Bam. Nice white daylight, just what I like, and much brighter than the previous bulbs. That's what the driver's side looks like. Good deal. I like it. Thanks for watching. By the way, if you're wondering on these light bulbs, they work great on a 66 Chevy also. This is a 66 Caprice, same bulb for the doors.